Very, very good morning from Tashkent, Uzbekistan. At the moment, I am on the way to Samarkand, which is another big city in Uzbekistan. And I will be traveling with a speed train from Tashkent to Samarkand only in two hours. And this is the railway station of Tashkent. I will pass the security and then later I will take you with me on this trip, guys. See you later. This is the huge train station in Tashkent. And the train you see behind me is the speed train, which will take us to Samarkand in two hours. And when it comes to the pricing, I actually paid only $10 for the two hours ride. And I think it's a very reasonable price when it comes to the, the time you spend on the way. And we will check out how's the inside. Amazing, they even speak English. They guided me where to go. And I've been told there's actually a restaurant inside, so I'm really curious to check it out. cafeteria area of the train it's actually it's not a real restaurant you can get your snacks coffee or tea there's a different choices I got my coca-cola and more stuff here Difference. What are what are the difference in the price? The price. Uh, 
For me it was $10 and yeah. business. Let's go. Yeah. Uh, this is our first stop. It's called Yizakh. And when it comes to the prices, it's very affordable. So $10 you can go in the economy, which is the cheapest. And then there's a business class for $15 only and if you want to get to the VIP zone then you pay $20 and for the two hours ride from Tashkent to Samarkand and the trains are super nice and it's only two hours ride and super fast as well so very affordable So I've been having conversations with the crew here. Actually, they were telling me the security is actually in the very high level here. They've been told me there was somebody lost almost like $20,000 in the train. And then after a few hours, they catch the person and then they brought the money back to the train. So, which is like amazing story. And also the cleanness and the stuff is very friendly as Uzbek people as very friendly as you know already from my videos and yeah so it's super nice super clean and the staff also speaks English very nice and you can also check out this beautiful view on the way to Samargan and on the way you can see beautiful mountains with the snow from far and actually not too far away there is a border with Tajikistan and other side of the mountains you see from the far it's already Tajikistan so finally arrived to Samarkand rail station this is the beautiful big hall wow look at this wow I'm already impressed by Samarkand Tashkent was quite modern city but even this train station looks much more cooler than Tashkent train station Samarkand Vagzal Beautiful, I think the overall train experience was really good I mean for $10 you travel from one big city to another and in comfort and speed and nice service uh, English speaking people and yeah all clean and uh, beautiful I loved it and probably I will be using trains more in, in Uzbekistan so now it's a time to get a taxi and then next we'll be going to the hostel You can actually see taxi cars in, in Samargan. In Tashkent, I didn't see any yellow cars at all. So basically what you needed to do, just stand on the road and do like this and somebody would stop because people are working as a taxi drivers in their free time with their private cars, but which is very different from Samargan. There is actually yellow cars and uh, taxi signs on top of the cars. I arrived to my hostel, but I cannot really find anyone here. But the room is super cool. Look at this. There's a second floor. Long table. And these items look super cool. Okay, I need to figure out or find someone. Okay, just found the person who led me into the room this is the entrance number nine it's my room my beautiful bag and single bed single room 
it's not nothing too fancy. I think it's just enough space to to be sleep and then spend time here. And there's a also a small toilet and as well shower. And the price I have paid from Booking.com it was around ten dollars for a whole this room. It's kind of like private room so but still considered as hotel hostel but I have my own room and own bed and as well as toilet shower which is private and beautiful I like this and there's a small TV <laughs> this is from probably 30 years ago that's how the TV used to look like there's also air conditioning as well Great, so I think this is the end of the video of my train ride from Tashkent to Samarkand. Thanks guys for watching and staying until the end of this video. Thank you and see you in another video from Uzbekistan.